Hi there, I'm Paul Ego and here's something you might not know. A cardiac arrest can happen to anyone. Anyone, anytime, anywhere, any why. Actually, I'm not sure that last one's a word. Is any why a word? In 1997, when my wife was just 30 years old, she suffered a heart attack followed by a cardiac arrest. It was the most frightening night of my life and if the ambulance hadn't turned up with an AED, I probably would have lost her that night. I wish I'd known more of what to do that evening and so I've got Mike here and he's going to tell us and me how to become a heart saver. This is Mike and this is somebody on the ground. What their name is we don't know. They're a bit busy at the moment having a cardiac arrest. So Mike from Heart Saver, I come across somebody like this. What's the best way I can help them? Well Paul, the good news is you don't have to be a doctor to save somebody's life. Yeah, well that's a waste of 10 years of medical school. I could have been a comedian. You probably still can. Not very nice. Back to this person though, how do we know he's having a cardiac arrest and he's not just having a nap? The symptoms for sudden cardiac arrest can vary. What we're looking for is no signs of life and the patient's not breathing. So Mike, I've tried to rouse them, I've called 111, now I get to work, do I have to do mouth to mouth? No, not at all Paul. We don't have to do it anymore for adult patients in cardiac arrest. If you want to, you can just do breathless CPR, which means all we've got to do is pump on their chest until an ambulance or an AED arrives. Oh, better than pumping the ambulance till the chest arrives, am I right? <laughs> Up high, don't leave me hanging. So let's reset Mike, we've come across this person having a cardiac arrest and really this could be anyone, couldn't it? That's right Paul, people think that cardiac arrest won't happen to them, but it can. So not just an overweight smoker is eating a pie, it could be a fit looking woman in her active wear, it could be a kid, it could be a guy from your office, it could be my wife, in fact I think that is my wife, isn't it? So let's do something Paul, we have an adult patient which means we can do breathless CPR, so we're going to slide our hand right up under their armpit, come through to the centre of their chest, we'll lock our hands together, we have a torso weight right over the top of the patient and we're going to press down nice and hard and firm one third of the depth of their chest. Mm -hmm. We're going to retract back off their chest again to allow the heart to refill with blood and we're going to continue that. Okay. Have you got a song in your head that we could use? Needs to be a reasonably good beat to around about a hundred beats a minute. Oh, I'm thinking maybe the song that my wife walked down the aisle to on our wedding day. Oh, another one bites the dust? That is an amazing guess. Yes! Just don't sing it out loud. Okay. 